Hi everyone, welcome back or welcome to my channel, Witness Love. My name is Corey. I hope all of you are having an amazing day, evening, and a good night. Myself, I am recording for outside, just having a peaceful evening here. And I decided why not to um, add out on top of all the massive June product empties that my fiance and I finished. So we're just going to hop right into it. We have this bin here and the Bath and Body Works big bag. I might just start with this big bag first to get everything out of the way. Finish a skinny syrup French vanilla. Skinny syrup salted caramel. Always love making our coffees. Finished a lot of fabric care detergent by Bath and Body Works. This is a fresh and clean bergamot waters. Love that scent in the fabric detergent. We have Dahlia. Just finished this a few days ago. Petals, praline, and tonka bean with musk. And this is a nice floral of which I can tolerate compared to sort of like gardenia and that stuff just not my <laughs> cup of tea. We have Coco Paradise here, very moisturizing with salted coconut manoi, sugar neroli, and bronze sandalwood. A gain odor, oh, <laughs> a gain odor defense fabric softener. Just wanted to uh, toss it, I guess. <laughs> Another moisturizing body wash in aromatherapy, eucalyptus spearmint. Love that for stress relief. We have a apple cider, warm apple cider donut philosophy, shower gel, and bubble bath. But of course, only using this really for body wash. And probably will not purchase any more philosophy products in the future. Because, yeah, this one definitely dyed your skin red and that whole mess all over the shower. We have these Him and Hers Biotin Builder uh, Wild Cherry Flavor. These have been definitely helping clearing my small breakouts on my face. And, yeah, with hair, skin, and nails growth. Always enjoy using Biotin products because why not try something new? We have this Twisted Peppermint Hand Soap Foaming, always a nice one year round. Fresh Amalfi Lemon, love this with the lemon, spearmint, and cedar wood. My uh, not one to give a F medicine, which is this extra th strength ashwagandha, a 3000 milligram, just yeah, take a few pills of these and you'll be coping throughout the day. <laughs> we have some Luminous products, the Pocket Back, the Exfoliating Glow Body Scrub, love those. And if you want to stock up on Luminous, it has been your chance and still is throughout semi-annual sale at Bath & Body Works. These are these Master Pin patches I and that is a whole ton of twister master pimple patches but yeah these definitely worked with that tea tree and salicylic acid with a few times I've used these and then Hayden used the rest of those we have a marble men's body lotion nice one with notes of Mediterranean waves, cliffside, geranium, and amber wood, but it did give off more of a fresh woodsy scent. You have the Fabric Care Fragrance Booster, so the Booster Beads, Palo Santo. Uh, the Detergent of Palo Santo, and the Booster Beads of Eucalyptus Spearmint. And throughout this bag, you just have four of these little car scents. Changed those out recently since I do run four different visor vent clips with any scent that I choose to put in Dolly. So now on to this bin here. 
On top, we do have some fine fragrance mist here, Gingham Glow. <laughs> I know that this uh, drop was, what, only um, three days back. It was this um, Monday, and yeah, I received this as gratis, and I just enjoyed this very much. You have Golden Nectar, Marigold Petals, and Sun Soak Sandalwood. It very much gives me orange blossom vibes, and I loved finishing up the Fine Fragrance Mist. One of my favorites from the semi-annual sale scents is Whipped Coconut Milkshake with notes of vanilla ice cream and sugared amber. And I have probably too many backups of that scent. We have Glowing Exfoliating Body Wash, a nice citrus along with what it provides in the shower. Aromatherapy, pineapple, lime, eucalyptus. This was a nice one to layer after using the glowing exfoliating scrub. A scent that Bath & Body Works needs to bring back is fresh coconut cotton. This is by far one of my favorite coconut scents with that coastal breeze and beachside cotton. This is nestle in freshly washed linens. Unwind with the warmth of a coastal day. And yeah, every time I worn this in the past and a few other bottles that I finished uh, last year, it's always been a nice use of, yeah, <laughs> spraying and layering with other coconut scents in my collection. We have a pineapple mango hand soap, cucumber melon gentle cleansing gel, Vanilla birch foaming hand wash, a kitchen lemon foaming hand soap, fall in bloom, and yeah, it shows juicy plum, wild blooms, and velvet something. I cannot read that because every bottle that I've had of fall in bloom, the packaging tends to just wear off, and I don't know how I feel. When certain products that I use, Hayden uses, especially for what you pay for, even if it is on sale, I feel the packaging should be better for none of the text to wear off if moisture is hitting it slightly. We have Among the Clouds, nice with berries and vanilla. Strawberry soda, you have notes of fresh strawberries, bubbly seltzer, and crushed ice. Enjoyed this. It gave off a milky strawberries milk body care. Firecracker pop body wash. Notes of red cherry, fresh citrus, and juicy berry. Nice for the summertime. Even for having those uh, bomb pops. A, another hand soap. Ice cinnamon rolls. Favorite for the winter. A body wash and butterfly finish a few more lotions white water brush into the night love always wins rainbow waves i love this scent two summers back compared to yes the pride collection that they released this year it's something different with the water lotus now i just don't see a lot of people gravitating towards the pride collection we have this Twisted Peppermint Body Wash. Always a lovely one to cool down with. This is a random um, body wash. He and I went to Columbus, Ohio a few weeks back to see Melanie Martinez in concert at her trilogy tour. And this was just the body care in the hotel room. So we finished the Warm Oak Body Wash. Another body lotion, Christmas cookies. Layer this with Gingham Glow. These two together, once putting on the lotion, spray yourself with all that Gingham Glow, you'll smell like uh, you are popping popcorn, but wearing it on your body. We have a candle lighter, finish that. Girl Scouts Native Deodorant, this was lemon. Um, nice to smell, not really to use on my body. It was, yeah, what I would have assumed to smell like those lemon cookies. It smelled like a kitchen cleaner. Leaves body cream. 
notes of crisp apple, golden nectar, and warm clove spice. Always a lovely one with the spice notes. More body washes. We have this First Sight 3-in-1 Hair Face and Body Wash. And I just realized, yeah, this is for hair and face as well for the 3-in-1. More body washes. There's a lot because, yeah, he and I use so many throughout each month. Fresh Amalfi Lemon, Pink Paradise, Tahiti Island Dream, Snowflakes and Cashmere. We have another Butterfly. A Strawberry Snowflakes Exfoliating Glow Bunny Scrub. A another Philosophy products like this one. I do not mind since it's the Shampoo, Shower Gel, and Bubble Bath. Plus it was lightly colored with the Lemon Custard Note. And this very much leaned towards Ice Lemon Pound Cake. Same exact scent, just different brand. Copper Fields. Notes of Harvest Sun. Fresh Wildflowers and Bronze Woods. Those notes definitely give off a nice bronzy feel and scent. It uh, smelled like, um, what? Coco Paradise. Yeah, that's the one I can't even think of in my mind because I just showed you at the beginning. Yeah, Coco Paradise. It was that nice coconut. We have Endless Sea, the Fine Fragrance Mist. That one I've always liked because it smells like hairspray. The Luminous Hand Soap. A Mint and Chip Ice Cream Hand Soap. Fresh Rainfall. A Pure Wonder Body Cream. A High Smile Banana Toothpaste. More than halfway of this bin here, we finished a lot of minis. So we have Pink Paradise, Ice Lemon Pound Cake, Sweet Whiskey, we have the Sea Salt Coast. Let's see what other ones are floating around in here. A Tutti Fruity Candy. Hot cocoa and cream, pumpkin pecan waffles. So yeah, that's a lot of small mini fine fragrance mists that he and I always try to use up each month, including with these big fragrance mists here. So we have Poppy. I wonder if they'll ever make this as a return um, in the next few years at Bath and Body Works. Notes of fresh morning dew. Wild Poppy, Sugared Rhubarb, and Juicy Pear. I love this very much. It smells like a strawberry rhubarb pie. Have a body lotion of Cocoa Paradise. At the Beach Moisturizing Shampoo. Another hand soap of Luminous. This is JLo's Miami Glow. Probably will not keep this bracelet. I don't know as of yet, but this is a lovely tropical treat uh, with coconut, passion fruit, and other fresh and tropical notes. It does lean off a little soapy, but this one is more tropical than her original glow. We finished more toothpaste, Colgate Max Fresh, the whitening toothpaste by High Smile. My favorite sunscreen, the Age Defense Hyaluronic Acid, SPF 50. Wild Sands Perfume, love this with the cactus flower and agave nectar. Happy Birthday, always a nice one for vanilla buttercream. Here we have a lot of wallflowers that are in this bin that we finished a lot of. We have the Downy Rinse and Refresh Odor Cool Fabric Rinse. Just decided to pick this up one trip that I took at the Dollar Tree. So why not just pick up a few items while you're there? Colgate Total Mouthwash. 
some more wallflowers that I'm just going to dig out. A couple others. There's another one. Finish a lot of pocket backs. Always try to aim to do that each month as well. Bridgerton, Diamond of the Season, Tropidelic, Pumpkin Cupcake. This is Sun Drenched Linen, Champagne Toast, Cozy Vanilla, Cozy Vanilla Almond, <laughs> uh, Bridgerton Study, The Queen Charlotte's Tea. Gingham Fresh and Crisp Morning Air. Lucky's over here being like, what am I doing? Just stared at me with all these empties. <laughs> we have the Aussie Instant Volume Volumizing Spray Gel. Enjoyed using this at the time when I, yeah, was always using hairspray. We have Tiki Beach Room Spray, a bright Christmas morning shea butter cleansing bar, some hand creams of the Cocoa Shea Butter, melted some wax melts, have to get a better move on doing so. These are the Salted Caramel Pretzel, absolutely love this since I am a gourmand lover. Hayden used this for his hair. Uh, Pre-shampoo, not your mother's tough love. Um, yeah, I don't know exactly what that was for, but I know he used that. We have a Whip Body Butter Butterfly. A Laneige Water Sleeping Mask. Another lip product by Eco Lip Scrub. Other tiny products floating around. Le Rosé. Pose, I don't know if that's how you say it, but this was a purifying foaming cleanser. Did wonders for the skin. This is the Ossier Body Butter. And lastly, Sephora Make No Mistake Foundation and Concealer Stick. So, thank you all so much for watching these massive June product empties. This whole bag is completely full from just me taking from the bin, putting into the big bag. Lucky says, have a good evening. So yes, thank you all so much for watching again. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe down for more videos. I will be posting next the massive candle June empties. So stay tuned for that. Have a nice day, good evening, and a good night. Mm -hmm.